Hey everybody, Jim Perry here. Welcome to Backroads Metal Detecting. So I am back out in the cornfield again today, uh, the site where I found the 1886 Liberty Nickel and uh, some of the other relics out here. So I know that the original road went through here somewhere and actually I believe that I have found it. It's gonna be hard to see here, I'll try to show you by video, um, but it's raised up here just a little bit as it goes through here uh, west to east. I'm going to follow this path up to just on the north side of these trees here where the house would have been and see what might turn out on this side of the property. So again, I know it's going to be difficult to see, but right in front of me, about 20 feet, just raised up a little bit. And I believe that's where the road went in that direction, uh, up to probably a couple hundred feet north of the two large trees that we're just behind the home. So, heading up in that direction, see what might turn out of the ground today. Right off the bat, I have got part of a spoon bowl, uh, part of a silver plated spoon. You can see that it does have plating on the back and the stem to it would have gone off to the right side here. So, uh, almost up to where the home sat. We'll go back and forth, kind of on the north side of the property here and see what might turn up. There were a uh, fair number of trees just in front of where I'm showing you here um, that there might be some items there too that were just on the north side of the road. So we'll see what might happen over here. I don't believe it. I think I've got another coin. Um, really squeaky, but repeatable 86. Take a look here together. It is about the same size as yesterday's coin, and it is definitely round. A little bit smaller. This is, I'm going to guess, penny. It is a penny. Let me get it cleaned up. It's uh, an Indian head scent. Let me uh, get it brushed off so we can see together what the date is. I have made my way uh, back up to the east side of where the home once stood uh, to where I found the Liberty Nickel yesterday. And I know it might be difficult to see here, uh, but this is an Indian head scent. It is 1891 and it is in gorgeous shape. It is in really, really nice shape. I'll get some photos up here for you to see. Um, Guess I should probably spend more time over here, uh, being that two days, two coins from in the 1800s. Uh, very cool. I've only got a little bit of time left uh, before it'll be too dark to see and I'll need to get home. So, uh, see if anything else turns up. There's where the Indian head scent came from. I just went to uh, get a fill in the hole and two and a half feet away, out popped an escutcheon from a door lock. Uh, I'll have to get some pictures up of this as well. The sun is just, it's playing with the light here, uh, but the keyhole uh, would be right there. So definitely the sweet spot over here. I'm not gonna waste my time anywhere else before I get out of here. Uh, my time is very limited. I would guess maybe 10 or 15 more minutes before it'll be too dark. Oh my gosh, I got another coin. Another one on the surface. Um, looks to be another penny. Boy, this is really thin though. There's definitely text on there. It's really thin. Let me um, try to get this cleaned up and see what it is. I am out in the middle of this huge field. It wasn't a coin, but I knew I had a feeling this was going to happen this year. I just found my very first token. Um, I'm not able to clean it up quite enough to see all of the lettering. There is quite a bit there that I'm able to see. Uh, good for five cents in merchandise. This would have been used in place of a coin at a local business. I am 
thinking I'm about done here tonight. I'm going to go home. I'm excited to get this cleaned up to see exactly uh, where it might be too. Boy, I can almost get the lettering there. Um, we'll have to see when I get home. Very, very cool. I am so glad I was out here tonight. I just I had a funny feeling eventually I'd find a token, seeing that everyone else seems to be finding them out in the middle of nowhere. Finally, finally my turn. And with that, I'm going to call it a day. I am leaving extremely happy. I was glad for finding an Indian head scent, but my first token, wow. I I know exactly where I'm coming back to when I get back out here. Um, this is where the goods are. Um, I'm sure that there's more coins sitting over here on this side of the property. So I've got an ongoing permission here. I'm welcome to come back anytime I want. Um, might have to wait a couple of days, but I do know exactly where I'm going to be for the next couple of weeks when I've got a little bit of free time. As always, thanks for joining me again today. Hope to see you again soon.